place down here that looks alive. Oh, oh, perfect. Huh. Oh. I'll meet you over there. I'm going to go take a look around. Or Fred. Did Romeo do all this? Maybe he regretted it in the end. I'm sure this isn't what you thought you were signing up for. Being an intern doesn't usually involve deadly adventures. Uh, what? Did you say something? No, nope, nothing. your feet. Ah, better. Still a little crispy, though. Ow, ow, okay, that hurts. Rest up, Radar, you've earned it. So strange to see flowers growing down here. Someone set up these lamps after the bed rocking. I wonder if Petra found something. How's it looking? Doesn't seem to be anybody around. Nobody inside. Should be safe. Safe-ish. Let's just get that weapon and get out of here. The one we used to have, back at the treehouse. Till someone, you, broke it. Uh-huh. Remember I used to read all the time? Now I barely do. Things change. Yeah. <gasps> Petra? What's wrong? Uh, n nothing. It just reminds me of... Uh, this, this story about puppies. Really sad story. You know me, I can't help crying about dumb stuff like that. Puppies, little chickens, rabbits that can't find carrots. Just ugh, gets me every time. Come on, Petra, you're lying. We both know it. No! Puppies just make me really sad, okay? <sighs> Fine. It, it's not the puppies. Doesn't this remind you of anything? Our friends? We used to hang out in that treehouse all the time. Now, we barely talk. Why does this keep happening? Everyone leaves and I'm, I'm just by myself again. I, I don't know what I'm doing wrong. I see them one by one just leaving. I kind of thought you liked it that way. You've always had this, I don't need anybody thing going on. I know. I just thought I could convince myself, I guess. Axel and Olivia are barely around. Who knows how much longer Jack's gonna stay with us. Didn't take long for the new Order of the Stone to fall apart, did it? My fault for thinking it would be different. Held together longer than most. That doesn't make it hurt any less, though. Just because we have our own lives doesn't mean we aren't friends. We still care about each other. They'd be here if they cared. I, I know this isn't important right now. Let's just find the weapon and get out of here. Something's not right here. Beds don't go with the banners? I always like the color blue, something peaceful about it. Whoa, it's an observer block. What's it looking at? The beds?
red bed. <laughs> kind of fun to say. This one's purple, very regal. Petra, I think we should talk about this. I told you, it, it's not important. We have bigger things to worry about right now. I get that. It's fine. If it's important to you, then it's important to me. I'm okay. Really. We have to take down the admin. After that, we'll figure out what comes next. Zara. That did something. One down. Now the rest of these need to go in the right order. Blue for Fred. Red for Romeo. Potato? That's the weapon? What are... What, what are we supposed to do with potato? That's not a weapon. It's a root vegetable. And not a very good one. I... Ugh, I hate potatoes. Please stop saying potato. Sorry. I guess I should say... Hashtag potato 451. Take this word of passage and use it at the primary terminal. You can take away his power and end this. Word of passage, huh? I guess that's the potato. I still have hope for Romeo. He just wanted us to stay together more than anything. I know that's why he's doing this. Maybe I'm being foolish, but I need to know for sure before taking this step. Though I guess if you're here, I got my answer. Maybe someday we'll be together again. Your friend, always, Fred. I kind of feel bad for them. Don't you? Yeah, I feel kind of bad for them too. This wasn't easy for any of the admins. They really cared about each other. Everyone talks about Romeo like he was this controlling monster, but Fred wrote that Romeo just wanted to keep them together more than anything. Isn't that what I've been doing? Especially to you? I don't want you to feel forced to keep doing something you don't want to. I don't want to be that person. Or, or make you feel scared to tell me the truth. You are nothing like the admin. Don't compare yourself to him. Even he didn't start out that way. It just got bad. I don't want to cross that line, too. I've been thinking a lot about what you said. Adventuring is what I'm good at. It's where I belong. Not in Beacon Town. But I don't want to... lose you. You mean a lot to me, Jesse. I... More than anyone else, you've been there. And I... I don't want to leave if it means you're my best friend, Jesse. I'll be right there with you, Petra. If you think your place is out there, then so is mine. Thank 
you. I always knew you were a big old softy. <laughs> You'll never be able to prove it. We'll see. We'd better get that book back to the portal. Right. Let's go stop the admin. His days of being Jesse are over. to call the others. We're getting out of here. What do you think you're doing? The portal is hidden for a reason to keep things away. We're still missing Jack, and this is how we get him back with us. Great. That won't be a burden. Sounding pretty admonish there, Zara. The weapon is what we need, not bodies to throw at the problem. People just complicate things, make everything messy, inefficient. No one, no one gets left behind, ever. I mean, that's not exactly true. You did leave that villager in my cell when we left the prison. But we, we need it... Well, from now on, then. Might be your downfall, waiting on others. Better be careful about that. As you can see, the portal's fully functional. You complete your end? Yep, I think this should send us home. And there's Fred's weapon. Potato. Hmm. Weird, right? I, I thought it was weird. Fred trusted him. He went to Romeo with the best of intentions and was... was... Ugh. There is no redemption in Romeo. None. He needs to be stopped. Once and for all. He deserves it. Worse. For this and everything else. It's the only way. You know that's not what Fred would have wanted. No, you're right. But Fred is dead because of his heart. Something else has to be tried. But heroes are supposed to help people, not hurt them. Romeo deserves what's coming to him. Fred should be avenged. Fred was the best of us, cut down. I can't let it stand. Romeo regretted what he did. He planted a tree for Fred. We saw it. A tree. A memorial is too little. Well, what about that whole game he built? He clearly cared about you. Once. Romeo destroyed my world, and I wasn't there to help it. He's stolen it from me. There is no rebuilding. I have nothing now. It's really over. All the things we made. Here, I found this, and there are good things left if you look for them. That you would... I... I'm not used to being wrong. Thank you. But we still need to move forward. All right. Let's get this over with. Hand over that trinket of yours. Jesse?
not the people from Fred's Keep. Those are mobs. Oh, just what we needed. Find me a bed when I had been so unhelpful. Go. Mobs don't stand a chance. Radar, 
We're not leaving you down here. We have to stick together. This is my time, Jesse. I know it. I have to do this. Go for it, Radar. I'll see you topside. Come and get some of this! Oh yeah, that's right! I'm talking about these huge arms! Keep past this! He's giving us an opening! Everyone now! Kid, come on! You could ask more nicely. But... where? Anywhere has got to be better than here! portals ever. I'm with the llama. <laughs> Is everyone all right? It's the old order's temple. We did it. We're back. <laughs> Radar would be flipping out if he were here right now. Standing where the great hero stood! This is amazing! Spot on impression. I mean, come on. You know he'd be all over historical Order of the Stone sites. He'd probably not want to touch anything. Too scared. <laughs> it was weeks before he'd touch the Order Hall front door without wearing gloves. Yeah, this place would have blown his mind. Will, when he sees it. Jesse, we are endlessly grateful to your friend for what he did for us. We'd thank him if we could. We didn't know if we'd ever see the sky again. Did you see that? Okay, somebody tell me I'm losing it. Thought my adventures were over I was content to let life pass me by That is, until a young hero Came along with a glint in their eye They said, Jack, do you think you can give me a hand? For mine is trapped in a glove from the sea I thought I had left the seas behind But the seas came a-calling for me It's a lonely road for a hero The road is a bittersweet friend For the road is cold and it's hollow But it's all you'll have left in the end Sure there is glory In my tragic backstory But that is not why I'm small For nothing built shoulders like regrets big as bold as sure as the grief takes its toll I'm thankful my arms are so ripped Or I'd been crushed from the start And I'm grateful my pecs are so jacked To hold the pain of my broken heart
my friends' faces, they'll never leave me. So I wrote them this sad serenade. For the curse of a memory that's perfect is that those faces, they'll never fade. Bless <laughs> my eye. <clears throat> it's a lonely road for a hero, but I won't be alone at its end. For I will wait in the shallows until we meet again. Until we meet again. Jesse, man, is it good to see you? Where are the others? <laughs> <laughs>